We're recording. We're recording. Say hello. Say hello. To, hello. to the woodworker back here working wood. About to put some stain on this big old tabletop. But alrighty scavengers, we got a special little treat for y'all today. We're gonna be taking apart this hyperbaric time machine flux capacitor uh, dealio that we found in the last video. Uh, it's actually a uh, uh, autoclave that's used to uh, sterilize equipment and things, I guess, uh, under pressure. As we had seen in the previous video, yeah, right here, had a little bit of a fire outbreak, little mishap, looked like a little contact or whatever. But I saw the date on this thing, it was May 2014, six years old, medical equipment, probably not designed to last two, 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 two. Well, you know, probably recommended to be switched out um, on a pretty regular basis. So they went ahead, tossed this in the trash. But we're gonna go ahead and pull, oh my gosh, she got melted pretty good. We're gonna go ahead and pull her apart for the uh, precious metals that she is uh, holding for us we got some copper some stainless uh some brass uh probably some um, some aluminum here uh but yeah we're just gonna go ahead and just just break her all down for y'all today and uh you know turn this trash into a little bit of cash so let's get it scavengers well we got it all broken down uh we got it the the uh, cleaned up materials over here this is all going to be like aluminum sheet that's going to be aluminum aluminum uh actually it's not going to be aluminum sheet it's going to be a uh this i think they give me a 60 61 or 60 62 one of the two this is the these are these are the nicer this one's going to be they're going to put painted on it so it's going to dock whatever i mean i know it doesn't mean nothing but uh, yeah, this is going to be a little bit more pricey aluminum than just the Rio. Uh, that may just be this sheet aluminum. It's a little bit nicer stuff than just say like the aluminum conduit stuff or the, uh, you know, that kind of crap. They give you a bit more for that. Uh, we got the uh, stainless tank here. This puppy's pretty heavy, probably 15 pounds. A little chunk of stainless right there. All this is cleaned up stainless over here. A lot of the construction was good stainless. And then this guy right here, usually I would say that it was uh, cast aluminum, but by the weight of it, it's gotta be stainless. It's freaking heavy. But yeah, we got all those cleaned up. We got some pretty decent stainless there. Over here, I uh, got a little number one copper all cleaned up. This is gonna be our cleaned up brass right here. This brass as it sits is what's called dirty brass. Uh, Cause it's, you know, it's got other materials on it too so i'll put this in the vise and we'll pull that piece off and then we'll turn that dirty brass into clean brass and then over here just some more tchotchke stuff i got to go through clean up uh this takes this has a uh, locking pliers on it so we got to uh or not the locking pliers the um oh the little lock washer thing on it that we got to get the little tool that i have with the needle the little needles on it open it up there 
and then we'll be able to clean that up get some stainless there there's some wires little motor you know a little bit of this a little bit of that you know stuff that i could just further go into and kind of clean up but uh all in all i think we got a few bucks scrapping that sucker out i mean it seemed a lot bigger than that didn't it uh but anyways guys already that is going to do it for this one on the uh cleaning up scrapping tearing crap apart if you will uh let me know what y'all thought about it appreciate y'all uh chiming in to check it out we'll see y'all on the flip side